106,000 people watching. There's more people watching this than there is people at the fucking Super Bowl. Connection you guys confirmed. Receiving incoming transmission from Icarus. Dude, let's go! Welcome. Let's go! To Olympus. Yes, dude! Hello, let's go! Let's fucking go, chat! Weeds! We're going comp on that mode, bro. We're going comp on that mode. are where the champions are crowned. But the arenas are where legends are made. I said danger close. Weren't you listening? The arenas are my games. They're not about fame or spectacle. They are about the fight. Arkstar! The rules are simple. It's just your squad and their Good. squad. Adios, champ. Whoever survives... Wins. The Octane skin! Now pay attention. This is how the game is played. Assemble your squad in the customary fashion. Before the fight begins, squads are enclosed in their spawn room and have access to the shop. Here you can purchase weapons, items, and abilities with crafting materials. I will grant you a set amount of materials at the start of each round. You may earn more through your performance. Materials can be used immediately or saved for superior equipment later in the match. No purchased gear follows between rounds. Where, it's Valorant. Where's all my stuff? It's Valorant CS. Yes. Yes. Materials can be used to upgrade weapons, making you an even greater threat. At the end of the buy phase, the shields drop and the fun begins. Both teams engage in combat until one side is wiped out. Downed teammates can still be revived. But in this game, there are no respawns. Use the pressure. It's the only way to survive. Supply bins containing consumables and material canisters are scattered throughout the arena. A single airdrop containing three weapons arrives in the middle of each round. The tier of the weapons in the drop pod increases from round to round. Use them to overpower your competition. It's high risk. High reward. Maybe next time, we should try a different path. The first team to score three victories with a two-win margin will be declared the champion. If teams battle to a deadlock 4-4 tie, round nine is my favorite part. Sudden death. Dotting up some amped cover. I'm opening the sky. Knock down more than a few. I am so fucking hyped, Chad. Each arena has its own personality and acts as an optimal combat testing ground. The phase runner on Olympus wasn't the first of its kind. A prototype long abandoned rests in a remote section of Talos. Luckily, it remains intact and functional, providing unique combat opportunities to those clever enough to seize them. There's a research afoot. And then, of course, uh... Coma was simply another Outlands hotspot turned yesterday's news until an ill-fated joyride gave it a new landmark. You're welcome. With my assistance, the city has been reignited with a new monument to incompetence. Thank you for this. I feel much better about myself now. I have also secured some viable locations throughout the Outlands to serve as arenas. And don't get too comfortable. The future promises to be a bit... fiery. I think someone's here! Oh yes. A new legend has joined the fight. This little one and I share a common legacy. Pilot blood runs through her veins. This is Valkyrie. Sending down Hellfire. She is 
as fearless as she is reckless. Friend or foe, make sure you look up as she takes the fight to the skies. Your journey ends here, legends. The skies belong to me now. The arenas are the ultimate test of skill and resolve. So I have a gift. The Bocek Compound Bow. This precision weapon requires patience and pinpoint consistency. It is made even deadlier with its two hop-up slots. Legends can combine shatter caps, splitting the arrow tip into a shotgun pattern, and Deadeye's tempo, allowing a faster draw when firing at the optimal pace. Master all of this, and you will become a true assassin. You gotta take risks to be champ. The need to prove superiority is instinctive. Hopefully, you can impress me. I'll see you in the arenas. Olympus Security Perimeter Alert. Multiple unknown ships entering secure space. All personnel, please secure docking stations and prepare for arrival. Security forces on full alert. Strap in, Muti. Things are about to get mighty interesting. Chat, this is the season. This is the fucking season. This is the season. This is the season. This is the fucking season, guys. This is the Daddy. season. For the fight like, that race skin is so fire. It is so fire, dude. And this, the game mode? Immediately or saved for super you may earn more. This. This. This is huge, chat. You don't understand. Like, it might just be a new game mode, but this is an entirely new way to play Apex Legends. This could go... This could turn into an eSport. It will turn into an eSport. I fucking guarantee you... I guarantee you this will turn into an esport, and I guarantee you this will be so much more a better fucking spectator sport than the current Battle Royale version of Apex Legends. This game mode right here, if they do this correctly, this could be as big as Valorant and CSGO in the esports scene. A new way to play tactical shooters. If they do this right quicks, yeah. So, for this game mode, obviously, Lifeline is going to be very strong. And let's think about... You're really going to have to think about, like, your team compositions here as well. So, one thing... Like, it's basically Valorant, but with the Apex movement and gunplay. So, it's... And the TTK, obviously. So, it's going to be less of a tactical shooter. And it's going to be so reliant on how you act in fights. Meaning that if your movement is cracked, if your aim and your movement is cracked and you know how to play in FPS, then this is going to be your game mode. Like, it's no longer about getting third party... It's no longer about this guy's got a Spitfire because he found it on the ground. This is the fucking game mode, chat. I don't know if you realize what ha is happening here. This is the solution to all of our fucking problems in Apex Legends. The Spitfire is not OP in this game mode because you got to buy it. If you've bought the Spitfire, that's your decision. Good on you. You know, you can no longer complain about it. You can't get third party because it's a 3v3. This is like, this is the pinnacle of Apex right now. This game mode. I feel like this is what Apex needed to be. No, no, I, I can't even say that because if Apex wasn't released the way it was, it wouldn't be as popular as, as it is now. This is the pinnacle of Apex. That's all I'm saying. Exactly, Haley. Exactly. Our saving grace, 100%. Yeah, Alakazam, it's so good. It is so good. Yeah, we are exactly. And like the battles are going to be so intense, dude. Like imagine, Yumi Han are stacking. We come up against like fucking free sweats that we know we're getting into that you know we're sweating that and we don't feel bad about sweating that we don't feel bad about it at all we're like oh it's fucking it's Katen and it, and those boys let's fucking sweat out dude it's so it's, it's literally the same format it's the same format it's just shorter games except they're going to expect the individual rounds to last longer i don't know if there'll be a timer on the rounds let's see if there's a like anything that we can pick up about having a timer on the rounds because if there's no timers and there's a lifeline well, fuck. Yes. A new legend this, has joined Val, the fight. Val, this Val. little one and I share a common legacy. Pilot blood runs through her veins. This is Valkyrie. This reckless. 
Then, so we got a Q. This must be her alt heal. She is reckless. Friend or foe, make sure you look up as she takes the fight to the skies. Okay, so it's like a jump tower. So it's like a jump tower. Now the question is, are legends able to use their abilities as they're going up? Um, Bonsai here. You can't really see much from it. Doesn't look like the ground of Bonsai is like affected much by it. Let's go backwards a little bit. Inside of the ship. Look down here, you can't really see much growth down there. It looks like Bonsai is infected all too much, but uh, Carrier is fucked up. Carrier is all fucked up. We can just. Difficult. It's the grave, my arm. Oh. Okay, so we've got like we've got new structures out here as well on the side. Uh, looks like our uh, fight night's completely gone. To be honest, oh no, I can still see the top of fight night there. So there might just be like a new wall here or something. I didn't carry that's phase runner. That's next to. Oh, right, you're right. You're right. Yeah, you're right. You're right. 100% correct. Okay. 